Sean Salisbury here with Jacksonville head coach Chris Hayes after another dominating performance. 15 to nothing in game one, six to two in game two. Another series win here at home. What'd you like about your, the way your team came out and dominated early? I just really, I really liked how our pitchers attacked the zone, uh, continued to put up zeros early for us, and then the guys were able to stack at bat after at bat after at bat, and really, um, it was really good to see the offensive performance today. We we're just talking to Trent Palmer about this too. When you have so many games coming up, what's it like to have your starting pitcher throw a complete game and really take? some ease out of who you might have to throw out there. Uh, it's huge, you know, and at this point in the season we've got some guys that are that are that need a couple that need a couple days off, that need a little bit of a break for Trent to go out and, and to take the seven inning ball game like that and then to get the to be able to put the, the game together the way we did, getting three innings out of Nick Love, three innings or two innings out or three innings out of, of Shanny and then giving one more to, to Zach. I mean it's a huge it's a huge relief for us and um, we're ready to roll for tomorrow's game. And a 6-2 to two win in the nightcap of this one. Five of those six runs came with two outs. What would you like about the clutch hitting and the patience at the plate? Well, it was really good to see Paul Castillo come up in a big spot early. Getting those three runs in the first was huge, and it really allowed our guys to breathe a little bit and, and to just play relaxed. So anytime we can come up with those two-out hits, man, those are the way we win ball games. You win the series, but I know you want the sweep, Coach. What's the key to taking advantage of that in game four here? Uh, tomorrow? Continuing that same momentum. Continuing, you know, pounding the zone putting up some zeros defensively, and then getting in there and competing at the plate, putting the barrel on the ball, putting the pressure on them. All right, 1 o'clock tomorrow. We'll talk to you then.